There may be a cover underneath here with seven millimeter screws holding it in. There may be one right here, under here, and then further under there. So if you use a socket and a ratchet, take that cover off. This vehicle doesn't have it. Now disconnect the connector right here. You might need a pick or a small screwdriver to try to get in the lock. Push in the lock, just right there, and disconnect the connector. There's a little tab right here. Pull that tab down, and then you can twist the whole lower motor assembly to the left, and it slides right out. Take the new blower motor, index that tab, Right over here, there's a little slide. So push it up right there. And when you push it up, then you're gonna twist it to the right, like you're tightening it. And just twist it, make sure it locks in place. That's good right there. You definitely have to put a little bit of pressure underneath. You should be good. Take the connector. Line it up, lock it in place. If you have that shield underneath here, replace that shield, put the screws back in, and you're good to go.